<laughs> Warn the teams to knock it off. There's already been some hacking and whacking prior to this game. Keep an eye on Edward Shallow, number 12 for Czechia in white. He'll be a marked man, and right away, Urban goes after him, but Urban gets the worst of that. Connor Brown works in for Team USA, and it's knocked away by Jakub Dvorak. Two good teams going head-to-head -head here, Craig. As we were watching it unfold, you, the temperature was low, but it was rising. And got point wise shot battles high off the glass. Of course, we're in the home of the Red Deer Rebels of the Western Hockey League, and for more than two decades in the West, the teams used to warm up separately. One team would warm up, go to the dressing room, and the other team would come out and warm up. And they used to have pre-game brawls in the warm up. Shallow works it and shoots! Well, what started it back in the day was you used to have to bring your own pucks. So if one of your pucks went down to the other end in the warm up, you had to go get it. And when players went down to get their, their own pucks in the warm up, that's when the trouble started. Oh, yeah. Well, they would take over territory. The, the bigger teams would just start to move over the center ice line and then move into the other team's zone. And Joe Connor works in. He's tied up at the corner, taken down by Dominic Padinka. Apparently one night in New Westminster, Ernie McLean's team, Punch McLean, took the other team's net and brought it down to their end and forced <laughs> it to come down again. <laughs> no. That seems a bit extreme. I think there was lots of extremes. <laughs> yes. You know, when, you, when we talk about it now, Gord, it's, 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 it's just, yeah, it is, really. It's just people you try to explain that go, what? I didn't even explain about the separate warm-ups. And people go, well, what do you mean a separate warm-up? Oh, absolutely. I mean, hacking and slashing away from the play throughout this first period so far. Musty. Plays that down for Smith. Now bump back to the point, and McCarthy back to pick it up. I mean, these young players are competitors, and we can talk about hockey on August 3rd, but they know what's at stake here, and they want to give everything they got, and that's why it leads to some testiness. Musty shakes off Mateo Kochi, and the puck bounces back to center ice. McCarthy back to pick it up. McCarthy really played for Muskegon last with year. Mateo Kochi. Yeah. Sorry, Gord. In comes Joe Connor in. Poke checked away by Mateo Check. Lead pass bounced ahead. Zidlitschke racing after it. Adam Zidlitschke getting in. And the loose puck poke checked away by Slikinski. That was a, a race that was tied. <laughs> and the puck skipped away. In comes Connor back with it. End of a long shift for him. Left side of your screen. Edward Schala has it now. Back for Jakob for Dominic Petter. Jakob Petter's son on this check power play and it skipped away from him. Jakub Dvorak back for it, plays it ring wide. Key point in the game here early on for the Czechs to grab the first goal as Petter fires it down. Wokinski plays it back in the corner. Here's Petter back on it. Dominic Petter plays in Finland for Luko Rama's junior team. Back in front it goes and down the ice it goes as Connor Brown slaps it down. It was a good real sequence for Team USA, you know, getting crowded in on that puck and outmanning Czechia, winning it, moving it down the ice. Bouncy puck at the point. Dvorak couldn't keep it alive. And it's moved back down as Rabal is way out to play it, but back down to the U.S. zone. Rozo, Minnesota, and War Road, that's a rivalry. <laughs> There's Shala. Plays it back down to Petter, top line on the ice for the offensive zone, face on for Czechia, and Shala kicks off McCarthy. He's done that twice in the game so far, just had an American player bounce off him. McCarthy's a competitor. He's going to get in for too long in Czechia. The biggest problem was guys coming to North America. Yeah. They don't have an issue so much with you know, David Pasternak playing in Sweden or some of that, but they do point out that some of their top players in recent years have been de have been developed domestically. Here's Petter with the steal. Petter shoots, and that's glove by... I mean, in the IHL is a 17-year-old, and, and that was a he league just couldn't get pushed away, and that was an older league. Like, yeah, that was, was guys hard. in the late 20s, early 30s. Well, hang on, he's in Vegas. <laughs> Lead pass for Connor busting in and racing on his rabble to take that away. Here's Connor. 
puck in his feet. Banked off the boards and knocked ahead to Dominic Petter. Lead pass for Zelitsky. Adam Zelitsky busting in the son of former NHLer Merrick Zelitsky. In comes Connor. Erdman works his way in. The ground that's swatted away by Rabel. The Americans are hauling for a penalty there. Connor works it and shoots, and Rabel made the stop on that just. Looks like it squirted out the right side of him. Now McCarthy jumps up to keep it alive. Locked down by Martin Matejacek. For Buffalo Area alumni who are involved with the Buffalo Junior Sabres. Jason Palmonville. Craig Reve is also there. Michael Paca. It's great to see. You see the same thing in Long Island. A lot of former Islanders are involved in minor hockey. St. Louis. Yeah, absolutely. Michael Peck is now assistant coach with the Rochester Amherst with the Buffalo Sabres farm team. He will be a head coach someday. Uh, yeah, I, I think Mike is so intelligent. Strathman. Winds his way in. Strathman with a dash. Stays on it. Andrew Strathman. Drops that back. And the centering pass from Connor Brown was blocked. Strathman plays it back in. Strathman trying to walk out of the corner. Matejacek took that away. In comes Cooper Pearson. Matejacek. Took it off his stick. And now Dominic Petter has it back. That pass hit a leg. And Dvorak with a rolling puck plays it over the head of Kuzma. Virgil wins that race in the loose puck. Mikey Virgil plays that back. Sharps shot to fuck it off a leg. Shala hacks it and plays it back to center right. Kuchera racing in and Sharp knocked that away. Part of being a top player and having to deal with it. Edward Shala doesn't back away from any type of challenge. And Urban went after him right off the face off again to start the second period. Five on five to start the second. Urban with it. U.S. had lots of pressure late in that first period. Here's Connor from a sharp angle, swatted away by Rabel. Strapman sends it back in. Zidlitsky stepped it in. The puck on the side of it bounces right back in front. Urban a chance. That deflected away. Rabel's lost his goal stick. Quickly retrieves that zone for Czechia. The penalty wasn't called, and Czechia takes the one nothing lead. Good throw. Plays for Pilsen's under-17 program. He's a late birthday, not eligible for the draft until 2024. And he was bouncing up and down, hugging guys, and all of a sudden, Jakob Petter, after five <laughs> rounds, looked at him and pointed that you're going in. And that ball was like, what? He made the one save. They scored in the next one and walked away with the win. Now a race to lose puck. Strathman gets back and pokes that away from Zelitsky. Brought right in and Connor with a shot. That goes off the leg of Dvorak and wide. Connor Brown plays it back in. Here's Connor picking it up. Joe Connor and Connor Brown on the same line for Team USA. That shot by Strathman goes high. Smith back down for Whitelaw. Will Whitelaw works that three, wraps it around, bounces back in front of Connor, a shot, and rips that wide. And, and that line, I think, is only becoming finer, Greg. Yeah, so. Strathman drops that back a minute to go on the Team USA power play. Connor back for Lacroix. AJ Lacroix drops that back to Strathman. Strathman holds, slides it back across to Whitelaw. Taken down by Volkvest. Whitelaw drops it back. In comes Straff and a shot. Pad save made by Rabel. Lacroix back to Strathman. Feeds it across to Whitelaw. Shoots and Rabel got just a piece of that. Not sure he saw it. Here's Lacroix back with it. Back to Whitelaw again. Shoots. Rabel pad save. Lacroix for Strathman. Drops it back. Here's Smith. Feeds it back to Whitelaw. Tees it up and shoots. That was blocked by Volkvast. The Czech bench is up and saluting that shot block. Picked up by Connor. A drive and the pad save. New win. He was 
you know, scouts will say this a lot. You, you couldn't take your eyes off every shift. Yeah, I mean, he scored three, and he could have had six or seven. Right. Zidlitschke, up in center ice by Connor. And Zidlitschke back into it. And Zidlitschke's stick knocked out of his hands over the glass and out of play. Challenge has become greater. Zidlitschke, by the way, plays for Kitchener in the Ontario League. His billets are here from Kitchener. They're traveling west to see family. Thought they'd come up and watch him play. Fabry pulls it out on the power play for Shala. Back he goes to Dvorak. Cross ice pass. Shala holds. Centers it. Tipped in front. What a stop there by Slokinski. Here's Dvorak with a drive. Slokinski the stop on that. The rebound cleared away, but not out. By Grammer. Shala to the goal. Very a sharp angle shot. Slokinski to save on that. Shala holds it again. Good pressure here by the Czechs on the power play. Kutra plays it down. Fabry. Takes a return pass and shoots. Kicked away by Slukinski. Now knocked back with that hard shot by Shallow is blocked. Dvorak back with it. Played back in the corner for Petter. For Yeko. Petter back on it. Slashes that down. Yeko. Plays that back around. Yeko side of the goal. The backhand shot. Stayed by Lukinski. And Lukinski, a good shot, a good stop there as Dvorak picks it back up. 45 seconds to go on the Czech power play. Petter, Dvorak, Yeko, Fabry. Back to Dvorak, the captain for Petter. Dominic Petter winds in. Centers it. Yeko missed on that. Great setup by Petter to Yeko. And the Americans can't clear it out here. Grammer peels back, brings it around, and Dvorak can't hold the line. He's tired, he falls, and a chance now for Erdman shorthanded. He's got Brown with him. Brown back in front, backhand shot put wide by Kinsman who had jumped up. The U.S. players were tired as well. <laughs> yeah, they've been hemmed in. No, it's an opportunity going the other way. U.S. controls off the faceoff. Here's Lacroix. Back to Strathman. Andrew Strathman. Flips it down to Whitelaw. Centered by Connor. That's broken up. And Dvorak on the second try lifts it out. Jakob Dvorak plays a lot for the Czechs. Power play, penalty kill. We'll play against the top line. And now wrapped around by Matijic. And down it goes. <laughs> Two shots for Team USA in that power play. And Kutra out of the box had that pass go over his head. Back is sharp to pick it up. That's center ice, a rolling puck picked up by Petter. So three games again here today. There'll be four on Friday. It's cooled off here in Red Deer, so the, the building's chillier. The ice is better. It was hot and humid on the weekend. Zavitsky knocks it down and shoots. Zavitsky makes the stop. The rebound put just wide by Petter. In comes Terrence. That centering pass just missed Adams. Top line back on the ice for Team USA. Terrence drops it back to Sharp. Sharp, rink wide pass to Musty. He goes rink wide again. That time it was broken up with a long shot by Sharp. Steered away by Ravel. Zavitsky. With his neck guard flying in behind him again. <laughs> the full ponytail. <laughs> Bouncing back to Petter. Petter walks the line. That's broken up. Lead pass for Musty was broken up by Petter, or Musty was all alone behind him. Yeah, Dominic Petter giveth and he taketh away. That would appear. Martin Nachash, the Carolina Hurricanes player. First round pick, that's where he played. And also the captain of the Czechia team that won the Holinka Gretzky on home ice. The only time they've won it. Yep. Yeah. In group A. But this is the game of the day. The semifinal spot on the line here. And the HX stepped into Connor there, and that has the Czechs cheering as Petter plays that back. Martin the Matijay check and Connor goes right back at him. He's going to get a penalty for it. 
third power play of the game for the Czechs. They're 0 for 2 with five shots. In comes. I mean, his dad, Jakob, is a tall man. Yeah. But, but, but we talk about young kids and how those growth spurts can occur in such short periods of time. One day you go to the fridge and the handle's <laughs> lower. Here's Dvorak with it. The dream pass here, plays it back in front. Fabry with a chance, poke check there. Good stop by Slikinski. Back across it goes to Shala. Shala. Rob set back to Petter, back for Shala, hold, centering pass, tip wide by Fabry, another good look for him. What a pass by Shala. And the puck skips by Dvorak and back down the ice. The way they work that play of oh, the grandson of Rogi Vachon is the backup today. Started the first two games for Team USA. Petter knocks it down. Brings that back in. Shala trying to keep that alive, knocked out. And Slikinski is still stretching. Doesn't look super comfortable. Just over a minute left in this first yeah. period. The echo. Works it and shoots. Flutters that wide. Second period. Shala to Petter. And the power plays over. One shot for the Czechs in the power play. Shallow works in. Shoots and fires that wide. 45 seconds to go in the period. Strathman. Lead pass for Connor. McCarthy's lucky he didn't get an interference penalty because yeah. he ran right through Dominic Petter as Dominic Petter was pursuing the play. In this second period, or third period rather, five on five. The United States must aren't out there killing penalty. Ryan Smith digging for it. Moved away from him and now brought back up by Strathman. Strathman chips it back in. Muscle off the puck by Dvorak. We'll see tons of him here in the third period. Erdman centers it and that shot fluttered wide. Jumping back on it is Connor. Brown comes in. And Shala plays it back to center ice as Matejic moves it back ahead. Pick it up. Plays for coach Anthony Noreen with Tri City. USHL team in Nebraska. Not to be confused with the Tri City Americans, the Western Hockey League, who play in. Washington State. Loose puck gathered up, and Zidlitsky was knocked off the puck by Strathman. Nice body check by Strathman on Zidlitsky. Connor plays it ahead, that's knocked away by Rochak. The puck moved ahead by Sprinak. In comes Connor with it. Connor centering pass, that's off the stick of McCarthy and wide. Defenseman Gavin McCarthy had jumped up. In comes Shala. Edward Shala in center. pass score. Eases him there, and then he puts it right on Spreinar's stick. You know, we know how good the skills are, but to understand, hey, when the time to strike and how to, you know, really right. put a, an opponent in, into a bad position, he's got that in him. In comes Connor with it. Well, your top five is getting crowded for the upcoming draft. <laughs> Sprinar. Up ahead for Petter. And his top line goes back to work as Petter fires it down. Shala. Back to the puck. Off the face, off the goal post, score! Ford is now putting the jinx on. <laughs> no such thing, Craig. We talked about this. She make another shot that goes off a leg and wide. White lock. Out to center. Matty Achik. Plays get, out of way. I get more enjoyment out of people. Oh. Accusing you of giving the jigs. You and I have the same mind on that. If I could alter events with my voice, I'd do it with a stock market, not hockey games. <laughs> <laughs> That's center right. Back to the power play. Fourth power play of the game for Czech. Yeah, they're 0 for 3 so far. Petter. Back for Dvorak. Dvorak back for Petter, walks in, holds, swings that back for Dvorak. 
Dvorak drops it back to Petter. Rossi goes for Shala. And Shala holds, elects not to shoot. Shala drops it down to Petter. Back at the point is Dvorak. Petter and Shala have switched sides now. Here's Petter. Slides that back down. In front of Shella, he'd worked himself free, but the puck skipped away from him. Move back for Dvorak. Fabry was looking for the loose puck. Petter sealed the wall, but Fabry comes in to help out. Lifted back out by Kinsman. Kinsman made a really good read on that play. He saw that the puck wasn't going to be. From Whitelaw, back to pick it up is McCarthy. McCarthy reverses. Petter was in on him. Shala out there as well, and Shala gets into Terrence. Shala and Petter causing all kinds of problems for Team USA. Here's Shala back around for Petter. Rolling puck. Slides that back to Kochi. In for Petter. Brings it back around Padinka. The defenseman's jumped up. And he takes down. To win an, a, another game with. Well, some work to do. A minute to go here in the U.S. power play. They have to get one here. Well, they need, they need three more goals. So in comes McCarthy. The spirit of your team is killed. Yeah, that's the, that's that's the, the problem. Like, you know, at, at, you get a chance. Now you need three. The players are realistic. And, and, now, and now your spirit is killed. That's the mistake. Right. In comes Terrence with it. Tied up by Dvorak. Oh, has he been good in this game? Yes, he has. Like, he's a... <laughs> He's an intriguing prospect. I'm not sure where he ranks on your list, but... Oh, he's he's in the uh, six four thirty two, six four hundred ninety one 191 pounds, 17-year-old. That's first round territory. Adam. I think everything in his game, too, is developmental. Right. Here's Musty with it. Final second with power play. Musty shoots and ramps off a stick. Like, at the, the day of the draft to make the swap. John Pickett, the... Over the island said, okay, we'll do it. And Marion Illich, Michael Illich's wife, said, we're not paying a million dollars for a player. We just bought the team. Whalen shoots, that's knocked away. Sharp angle, that's put wide. Um, Michael Illich bought the Red Wings for, I think, four million. Yeah. Yeah, that's significant money now to go spend four million at that time yeah. and then another million on a player. But uh, yeah, they were the dead things back then and they, uh, they sprang to life. But yeah, I mean, Eiserman was out of Peterborough, and well, that was the aftermath of the draft, right? Like after the year, but you know, just going back, yeah. like you know, Steve was a top player. Obviously, everybody knew it, but you, you always wondered, like, what do they remember about going into yeah. the draft here? Definitely coming now to the Czechs again. They've one goal against Finland, one goal so far here against Czechia. Two goals in their last yeah. two games. The offense to say it has dried up would be an understatement. Yeah. White lot knocks it back. Here's Straff with a shot. He ripped that wide and time winding down here. You're going to see a celebration on the Czech bench in under a minute. The likes of which you won't witness up very often at this tournament. Musty. Long wrist shot tip wide. Adams back on it. McCarthy, back for Strathman, shoots, and once again, Bravo got a piece of that. Whitelaw spins and shoots.